Hold on. Hmm? Do you think men are just addicted to women impressions, or what? What do you? What do you? What, what was you? I don't do understand you your question. Men are addicted to women. Yeah, I, you think a man is just gonna just be out here? Huh? So, <laughs> listen. Yes? I don't know if it's the woman per se, but it's it's you know her. her addict, addicted. Her to well, it is sex. You know what I mean? Men like, on average, on. men on average think about <laughs> sex nineteen times a day. On average, men think about sex nineteen times a day. Well, this is just real. This is just woman, how it is, right? And women yeah. do women do a lot too, but we execute. Yeah. We execute, oh, right? Like I said, 15 times the testosterone. Here's the thing. Wait, so but we don't have to have sex with all these different Hold women on. because, like I Hold said, on, no, we don't. It turns dangerous don't. because these women are nuts. Hold on, Mr. Lego. The, the, See what I'm talking everything about? That, everything that that lady said was essentially, and he's still going to cheat on you anyway. That's yeah. basically what she was saying. There is nothing he going to do yeah. because, me, because if he... If he has a high body count, he's still gonna cheat on you anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Here's the reality. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's the reality. Men do it all the time. We ask women to marry us all the time. We we find a woman and say, "Hey, can you? I, I want to marry you." That's him having an attachment because basically what she was trying to say was because he has a high body account, that means he doesn't know how to attach to a woman. So that means he doesn't know how to turn off having a high. He doesn't know how to turn off dealing with multiple women. So therefore, he's gonna he can't attach to a woman. We do it all the time when we ask mm -hmm. you to marry us. We settle down all the time. We're not even the ones walking away from our marriages most of the time. Women are usually the ones that do the shit, not men. They're traumatized. We do <laughs> it all the time. Now, what she was trying, what she was really trying to <laughs> say not a was, believer. <laughs> what she was really trying to say is, if he has a hottie body count before he gets with you. That man, he gonna continue to cheat on you after he gets with you. That's literally what she was saying, but she was trying to paint it into this in, into a different thing. We know what you were saying. How how is a woman not our responsibility? She's not our wife, and we're not with with her. But then she's having sex with us. She traumatized and needs to heal, and it's our fault. It's, she was traumatized by her no, parents, no, I'm, I, not, no, not by us. Not, now she's traumatized we, wait, by our parents. On. We didn't traumatize them. Their parents traumatized them. I remove all that. Women, I'm going to tell y'all right now, we didn't do shit to y'all. Your uncle, your mama, your daddy, all them people. Y'all were traumatized when y'all were five, six, nine, twelve. Before we even, before you were even into men, we didn't do it. Go ahead. So what is, so, so the men having sex with them ain't traumatized? No, they're coping with their trauma by having sex with us. So the, the men, are, so 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 the men are dogs and cheetahs and animals, and the women just traumatize, and, and we're using them. That's what you're telling all the society. Uh, so, 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 so young hold boys, hold young boys, let me, let me finish. Young, let me finish. Young boys ain't been touched. Young boys ain't been sexualized. Young boys weren't weren't shown by women what sex was. You're saying all these things happened to girls, but all these things weren't happening to boys. That's what you're saying. So when I'm having sex, when I was having sex at a young age, I was just a dog and a user. The woman was, I was traumatizing her. She wasn't traumatizing me. I didn't say you was traumatized. I literally said, "Oh, her parents. No, my parents. Uh, the same anymore. parents. Those those same parents didn't traumatize traumatize men." A lot of times, a young girl that start having sex at the age of 14, 15, she's trying to answer escape. my question. Let go, bro. No answer. No, no. You're not. You can bro, do it on your. I'm show. not here to ask no, your goddamn our question. Men, you want to have a conversation? Our, our men traumatized. Can you, can you calm down. Our men, you, no, you said you something. It's my turn to talk. Easy, talk. easy, easy. Our man, uh, easy, talking. talking. No, I'm gonna talk. You ain't gonna do talk to me Bro, like that. You stop gonna be talking. Crazy. The host so, can ask me that. You're not gonna tell me to stop. Okay, talking. can you can you calm down? You asked me no, a question. I'm, I'm trying to ask I you ain't question. even hype. I'm, I'm trying to ask you a damn question. No, you're not. Can I ask you a question? Yes or no? Go ahead. Let's try. Thank you. So, the young girls who start having sex usually it's because I didn't ask you that. I didn't ask you that. And I, I, I'm, I, I'm not even talking about women. Finish? No, because I'm not talking about women. You making it Bro, about women. I'm, I'm gone. I ain't got time for this. Shit. I'm sick of this fucking dude, Let man. God then. damn. Let you you fucking obsessed with me. You this shit is gay. You, you ain't trying to help women. You make women feel good. All right, you bro, this shit is gay. Women. You keep, keep okay. being up. Yo, this nigga is obsessed point, with me. You say women are children. You, you say ask women are children. You say women are children. You say what women think don't matter. He 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 do this, man. He out of control. He don't tell women. No, he don't give no women good advice. He don't give them insight on how to have, on how to make proper attachments, on how to how to invest in themselves and be women. Go to men. Go to women. Go to healthy relationships, just like Trev be talking about. Get advice for married people. Get advice for a woman who has a relationship that's working. He don't tell them none of that. 
he just tell them what they want to eat want to hear just for those just for those in the comment section if y'all don't understand ali asked him a specific question he said are boys not traumatized because we are coming from the same parents he did not answer that question that's the question he was trying to figure out because every single time he wanted to rope women, rope women, rope it back to women and say, well, when the women have multiple sex, multiple sex partners, they're traumatized. So he was asking them a simple question. So if boys have multiple sex, doesn't that also mean that they might be traumatized because they're coming from the same parents? They have to be traumatized. It ain't no might. They have to be traumatized. We know boys be traumatized. We work in mental health, but we don't we don't limit them. We're not uh, us as adults ain't supposed to limit people to anything. We have to grow up. If you encounter something that was bad, we have to learn from our bad experiences or we're held to those experiences for the rest of our life. It is not my response. I'm not Lady Di's not responsibility. I have no coverage and authority over her. Women, other women that I have no coverage of, they're not my responsibility. So if they say they're not going to submit to me, they're not going to be my wife and they I can't control them. How then is it my responsibility to make sure they're a good woman and show up as a good woman? That's that's crazy to me. I'm with you, Ali. I'm with you, bro. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with the what's going on with the men tonight, man. Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> nah, we all right, we all right, we good, we good. We good. We good. As we good. I, as soon as I played that Joe Button uh, video, as soon as I played that Joe <laughs> Button video, that same energy. Did, did I tell you, Trent? <laughs> did I just tell you we get passionate when we had these discussions? It's the same thing with that Joe Button happens, video, man. We get passionate. Yeah, it happens. But it tomorrow we're gonna be good again. But y'all acknowledge Trev. Look, every time I talk to Trev, I know he's listening. When I talk to Sweeney, I know he's y'all are very intentional. Let go, flip flop. Let go. Just say women are nuts. But then he'll turn it back around and say they traumatized. And then he say they make bad decisions. But then they say he they children. You we gotta make we gotta make our minds up. Are they do they have to be are they adults or are they children that's traumatized? Are they nuts and make bad decisions? Which one is it? Our women have a big responsibility. They have to be our foundation. We, As a society, we are dropping the ball and not giving our women instruction and making sure that they're shamed as much as women, men are shamed when they're, they're not being fit. It's important. I feel like that part is important. That's important. You gotta, you have to hold men and women accountable. No matter how you spin it, you have to hold women accountable. You have to hold men accountable. That's, that's all of our jobs because this is what to. we do, right? All of us do this as individuals, right? We try to help people, uh, whether you want to call them advice, <laughs> consult, whatever. It's our job to let them know when they're doing something foul and when they're not doing the things that are right. We have to pull coats. But and when women that's... hold that's... other women accountable, they get, you know, oh, don't don't talk to her like that. You know, you're being too hard and all the stuff that happened earlier on this show. But hey. And that's the reason why when it came to even when it came to <laughs> vegan, I was like. I'm, that's why I was like, basically, you tried to use the young and dumb excuse. And that's why I had to tell them, I'm like, that young and dumb excuse is just an excuse to tell somebody, hey, you need to take me as I am because I experienced this and I was just young and dumb. But you don't. But we don't tell people what you're supposed to do is even if you did make a dumb decision, you're supposed to come to that person completely accountable for the decisions that you make and then show that person by telling and showing them how you can be an asset to their lives. We don't never tell people that they have to do that. We always just, they just use it as a catch all. Well, I was young and dumb. Well, what am I supposed to do with no, your I young and it. dumb decision? But you, and, and then we could have dissected, and I'm not going to dissect her. I'm going to leave her personal relationship out of it. But once she brung up that there was a, that she had a kid and there was another man involved, and then you moved out of that state. And, I, and I'm saying in general, I'm not even, I'm using her example. I'm not even talking about her, but I'm going to use her example. You move out of state to be with another man. You had to move him away from the child's father. Now, if that guy was in a good quality and this guy was in a good quality, that means you're prioritizing you. And that man probably checked out because he wasn't getting peace in that household. And he was prioritizing a, a woman that he wasn't married to and a child that wasn't his. He he was awesome. they both were in it for probably the wrong reasons. And I'm saying not her situation, but I'm using it as an example. When women prioritize being that lifeline for a man, loving that man, catering to that man, y'all know how we are naturally. If a woman does one thing for us, we want to do five, but we make sure we love you first. No, don't, don't say we in an intimate sexual relationship or situation, but if we love you, Trav's going to do times five, Sweeney going to do times five, and we build a genuine relationship and something that we value, and so, I will build with you. 